We are walking to the Okayama Castle. Over there. So we have entered the Okayama Castle. Going up, there is a little bit of a long walk. Oh, staircase. <laughs> but okay, I'm in my get off, but let's do it. Oh, we're here already. It's not too bad. Um, oh, wow, look at the castle. Okay, so Okayama Castle is very special because it's a, a very rare um, black castle in Japan. actually a place inside the Okama castle where you get to experience pottery called the Bizenyaki. So I'm gonna make a little bowl. Stay tuned. Like this. You just keep spinning. At this moment, my bizayaki is completed and I've actually carved uh, at the bottom hashtag cheesy in Okayama so I won't ever forget <laughs> and um, it's gonna take about a couple of months to burn, cook, grill, bake, bake. <laughs> I don't know, to complete this whole process and it will be sent to my address and I'm gonna show you guys when it's completed so check out my Instagram I'm super lucky today because we are at Okayama Castle and this is specially brought for me. Um, it's sake, Japanese sake and also liqueur by uh, Japanese sake brewery Sakura Muramachi and we have like award-winning sake right here and some really fruity liqueur and I'm gonna try it. Um, first I'm trying the award-winning sake called Sakon and it has won a Los Angeles International Wine Competition. I'm gonna try it. Um, it tastes very fruity and actually the alcohol is kind of high, it's 16% but it's not too overpowering. It's very mild and very easy to drink. It's very delicious. So I'm trying the second sake, it's called the Seto Omachi Junmai Sake. Ah, okay, this tastes really like sake. The previous one actually tastes so fruity that it kind of has a wine taste to it. And this is very typically sake and you could taste um, the essence of the rice in it. And I think that it's perfect for uh, to pair with a Japanese course meal. 
Okay, it's really hard for me to decide which one I like best. I think both of them have their own characteristics. Um, but if you miss Okayama, you should try it. And these both are born in Okayama uh, sake. And the good news is you can actually find it in Malaysia. So go hunt for it. Thank <laughs> you.